On this show, we research and reach out on occasion to our area's thought leaders and ask how our region will look by the end of the decade. We call it California 2030, and tonight we focus on the future of law enforcement from former Sacramento County Sheriff John McGinnis and why he's so concerned about law enforcement's dwindling numbers. The reluctance on the part of people and the general public to pursue law enforcement careers. I hope that changes. I suspect it will. When I started, there would be thousands of people that would show up uh, and test for uh, just a handful of positions. And that was the way it was until relatively recently. We did start seeing some changes, though, in the, the early part of this century, 2006, 2010 timeframe, where you had significant numbers of applicants. But as you go through the process of screening background checks, there are a lot of uh, a lot of conditions in a person's background that simply made them unfit for employment as a peace officer. I think there does need to be an encouragement, an invitation for people to recognize the benefits of the profession. It's a wonderful life. I absolutely loved it, and I worked with some of the finest people in the world. But then understand that if you're interested in it, there's some things you need to know, and some things you really truly need to refrain from engaging in by way of your conduct along the lines of uh, of uh, drug abuse, obviously, uh, of uh, specific intent criminal conduct uh, and even financial management because you cannot in good faith send a person into the field of law enforcement where they have entree to people's possessions to the, the uh, in many cases uh, called into people's homes when they're not there if they have uh, a significant financial problems so the whole package has to be uh, in place all right brought that one back tonight john appreciate it you can catch all of our california 2030 series available on demand just visit our streaming service or YouTube page or our website, of course.